Hey guys, I want to um, go over something with you here with home gauge. Okay, um, now I've got this beefed up here, this overview comment. Okay, um, basically yours guys is stop right here. Now I've had this added to mine for quite a while, this right here. And basically it says ice damming is a potential concern with most roofs. Oftentimes it cannot be determined if ice damming has been occurring or will occur in the future given the right circumstance. If ice damming does occur on the edges of the roof or in the valleys, there is a possibility that moisture can seep into the home and cause moisture staining and or damage. If ice is starting to form on the roof edges, then immediate attention should be given to it. Rake in the snow. Break in the snow off the edge of the roof or installing heat tape on the edges of the roof and or valleys can help prevent ice damming. Ice guard is a product that protects against ice damming. Ice guard is placed under the shingles and is therefore not readily visible and most times cannot be determined. If ice is beginning to form or ice damming is occurring, then you should contact a qualified roofing contractor to further evaluate and correct as necessary. Okay, so... You guys don't have that in your header, so this is it right here. So I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna email it to you, okay, and um, and then you're gonna follow this video link, okay, and um, so let me just copy this, okay. I'm gonna copy that, and then I'm gonna go to emails, and I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna paste it here for now. Okay, some of you guys might have that, but I don't. I don't know. I didn't. I checked a few of you guys, and uh, the ones that I checked did not have that under the header. Okay, so let me go here. So this is where this would be at. So let's just go to like, uh, let's go to like print preview, and uh, you, I'll show you what I mean. So we go under roof section, right here, the header. Okay, we've been getting a lot of calls on ice damming this year, and uh, you know it's it's something that we cannot determine. So, but this is pretty important to put in the report. I know that we've been hitting it pretty hard when we do see it, but even if we don't see it, you know, I mean, we need to get this in here. But um, you know, when we do see it, we we want to mention it. So, and um, so, anyways, this is where I want to see it right here. No, I'm sorry roofing right here right here is where we want to see it so let's go to um, what you're gonna do we're gonna go to report here let me close this out cancel all right so when you when you get when you get that comment open up your report go to your template like you're gonna work on a new one here select your template okay oh, where's my template right here open template Okay, and then what you're going to do, you're going to go to roofing section. Okay, you're going to um, go to overview. And what you're going to do is you're going to just paste it in here. So um, let me, better yet, let me go to another one here. Let me go to, um, let me go to like, uh, let me close this out. Let me just go to new. No, okay. I'm gonna go to one that doesn't have it. Uh, let's see. I think uh, where's Bob's? Right here. Bob doesn't have it. So I'm gonna open up his template. Okay, and then I'm gonna go to report. This is inspection styles and materials overview. This is where it's at right here. So what we want to do is. We want to take what I was emailed to you, go over here, and then paste it in there. Now it's got the whole thing. See the whole thing in here? So then you're going to go over here, and you're going to hit this plus sign right here. Create new form text. Boom. Okay. And that's the one you want. So, okay. So put automatic you're going to get that in there automatically and you can pop 
there. Let me just try something else. Do you want to save changes? No. Let me let me just cancel. Do you want to save changes? No. Okay. Cancel. I guess I did already. So. Okay, so here it is right here. Okay. So, now I got the comment in here. Okay, so this one here has got an automatic. Okay. So we want to go over here. See that Y there? So we want to click on this one, hit the toolbar. We want to take it off automatic. Okay. And then hit OK. And then we're going to open up this one, the new one that we just copied in there. And we're going to hit the tool wrench there for edit. And then we're going to hit automatically include and comment on report start. Okay. And then we're going to hit OK. Okay. And now it's got the Y. And now we're going to hit um, cancel. Okay. So now every time you open up a new report, it's going to be there. Okay. All of this. So anyways, that's what you guys got to do. If you need any assistance with that, just get with me and hit save when you're done. When you close it, hit modified report template, say yes. Save it, yes. Save changes to report, yes. Okay, so anyways, I'm going to record that video and I'm going to send you the link in this video. And I'll put that link right there. Roof overview comment. Okay, so now I've been recording that, so I'm going to hit stop and then 